I'm Carrie Muiz, an artist from California. I came to Paris in 2000 to study at La Sorbonne and to research uh, psychoanalysis and Sigmund Freud at the Bibliothèque Nationale de France. At the end of 2000, my friend Jeanette O'Keefe was murdered. We all lived in the same student house together. There were about 50 other people, but I was the one compelled to identify her body. She was Australian. At the time, it was a huge international incident. I began painting the statues of Paris immediately after we moved out from the foyer, and behind me is the first statue I ever painted. I identified with the statues of Paris at the time because I was mentally traumatized and looking for answers. Um, the, I became extremely agoraphobic after her murder, and I internalized that uh, trauma, which is why I identified and clung to the invincibility of the statues. One of the things that happened in my nine years of being agoraphobic was that her case was solved. I just wanted to give a little bit of insight on why I do what I do and why this city has provided me with a sense of invincibility in terms of the architecture and the wonders that are here. Just as in everyday life, there is trauma, but there is also magic. It is so important to me to know that in a dark world, that there is something that can still be clung to. Beauty is a resistance, it is a rebellion, and that is something I incorporate into my work each and every time I approach the campus.